Okay, we have this smartphone oneplus n200 from metro pcs and any other carrier that support this phone the screen is locked blocking with uh, password pattern or pin and let's go really quick and do a hard reset to remove it in case that you forgot this credential and it is very very important that you know your google account associated with the phone because after the factory reset you have to confirm or verify google in order to proceed and get to the home screen and use your phone so and uh, go ahead and remove any external memory card and sim card to save some files that you have on that card because uh, uh, this is basically, basically it is a uh, factory reset that everything is going to be deleted from the internal memory okay so let's go really quick and uh, power down the phone the phone power off you're gonna press and hold volume down and power key for three to five seconds as soon as a logo appears on the screen, remove, uh, release the volume down, but continue holding power key until you're going to see a, a keyboard on the phone and then release um, the power key, okay? So let's go really quick and volume down and power. Okay, logo appears, release uh, volume down, continue holding uh, power key. Okay, when you see this uh, uh, this uh, keyboard, just release the power key. Okay, now at the volume uh, at the bottom of the screen, it says forgot password. So let's go in, uh, select forgot password. Okay, so now um, instruction: you will lose everything, music, pics, etc. Uh, if you agree with that, just uh, okay. So this is how this is why you have to remove your external memory card. And um, what the good news is that after the factory reset with the same Google account associated with the phone, you will be able to retrieve any pictures, videos that you have already uh, uplo uploaded to your Google Photos app. Okay, so don't worry about losing anything. And contacts as well. So hit OK to continue. And um, wiping, please wait. Just here the phone will start to it is already uh, delete everything stored in the phone and um, basically the phone will be um, it's rebooting right now so just uh, wait and hold and in case that your phone gets stuck on the screen any logo that it won't take you on the initial setup screen to continue register language and Wi-Fi and so on just uh, long press the power key to power down the phone and for up to 20 seconds and then start over again with the same process in case that with the power key won't turn off just uh, hold the volume i mean volume up and power key for at the same time to power down the phone okay in case that uh, it won't work with the power button only okay, so this is our initial setup screen uh, basically we are going on the way for the phone to ask us to select the language that we want to um, have on the phone so right here you can touch the arrow and open up all the languages that is available for your um, n200 smartphone and select your desired language and um, continue start okay terms and conditions uh, let's go and touch agree and then confirm that you agree with these terms and conditions take your time they want disclaimers now uh, now you can go ahead and connect your smartphone on a wi-fi or you already have a active sim card from straytalk or any other uh, carrier then uh, or to detect network because uh, you have to detect network in order to continue because you have to verify google in order to continue and use your phone Okay, because I don't have anything on the phone, it let me set up offline. So just I'm gonna conti uh, continue. And since you don't, if you already have internet on your phone, automatically will detect your uh, time zone, date, and time. Uh, but if you have to, if you want to select manually, just select your uh, select your time zone and uh, date and time on this area with the arrows. You can move and uh, select your month and hit ok to save and now the time just uh, you can highlight the minutes hour 
AM or PM, okay? And then uh, hit OK. When you, when you touch OK, your changes say it's been saved. Right? Touch Next to continue and accept terms and conditions from Google and also Google services. I highly recommend you to leave as it is because use location, basically anything that you go and search on google search engine the first result that you're gonna get is the one that it is on base uh, based on your smartphone location and also scanning any wi-fi available in your area that you can take advantage of to save your package data from your carrier and also any updates for your android they will be sending you re reminders to download any update uh, on your uh, Android to perform better okay so and also install update apps any applications that have any updates that you, you will be able to re, uh, download it user experience building up uh, apps push notifications everything um, <clears throat> I will say agree uh, for them to uh, use on your phone carrier location access if you want to grant access on your location uh, go ahead and touch the red button if don't then um unfortunately we have to say yes because they won't let us continue if we don't um agree with that all right set lock screen you can go ahead and set up your lock screen with password a pattern or a, a four digit pin we can skip this one for now because you will be able to set it up once we get to the home screen you can go to settings and um, uh, set it up from there okay so now here <clears throat> uh, this is your type of phone you have you had an option you going to have a, a like highlighted or regular font on your smartphone so you can choose any of these and your selection will be turned blue so just select and hit next to continue now you have you can you can navigate your screen with navigation bar or gesture so you want to have gesture the next step um, we will show you how to um, perform this or if you want to prefer um, buttons just leave that that's a classic uh, way to um, move your screen so so this is a basically tutorial how to um, move your skin with gestures so this is a, basically a, a tutorial you have to practice from uh, left to the center is to go back to the previous um, bottom to center it's a home screen and this is your page tray tray okay so any websites that you've been um, navigating and this is the tray you're gonna show you on the screen uh, how to okay it's basically it's a history of the things that you've been um, you've been uh, navigating on your phone so this is how to have reset this uh, oneplus nord 200 i hope this video was helpful for you let me know if you have any questions please subscribe to the channel and uh, any questions let me know in comment section okay thanks so much